soon. Well, next time you're out on a walk and you see these, stay away. Hank Kevin Arrow is here to tell us about the dangers. They look so cute though, Hank. Yeah, Terry, these creatures are called asp caterpillars and you look and they're furry and look fun to play with, but these hairs actually have an irritant on them and that can cause issues for you and your pets. Now, an entomologist with Texas Parks and Wildlife told us these are pretty common in Texas, native to Texas, especially around this time of year. They start to pop back up. He said most people know you shouldn't touch them, but animals don't know any better. It's especially a problem for dogs who like to sniff their surrounding. If these hairs get caught in their lungs, it can cause inflammation, which could stop their breathing. But a local veterinarian says it's most likely not going to be that serious. So when we would want to see them is if there's like swelling occurring, especially if they put their face um, and the face starts swelling, we always worry about um, is there uh, also a reaction occurring where the airway could be compromised. Um, so if the face starts swelling or the eyes start swelling, then, then we want to see them. Now, if you brush up against one of these, get all the hairs off you as quickly as possible. And that will stop the irritation. Same goes with your pets. Now, one of the best ways to do that on yourself is actually using tape to pull those hairs away. And make sure you're not spreading the hairs around your skin. Chris and Terry. Yeah, so I won't be petting any of those anytime soon. <laughs> it's amazing the stuff that we have around us that we think looks harmless and it turns out not to be. I know, know right? <laughs> like pollen, pollution, allergies. <laughs>